Guys, I'm doing back-to-back -back Norm Macdonald reactions today. I just barely did. Don't laugh at that. And again, <clears throat> you'll probably if you've, go check out that video. Maybe I'll reference it in the description down below. But I just don't get why he's so funny, dude. But he is, and it's freaking hilarious, man. Um, my goodness, so funny. So the the next one we're gonna react to today. This is part one of two. We're checking out Norm Macdonald. Best of Jokes Part One. All I'm seeing on this on the screen right now is Norm dressed up as Colonel Sanders, and I think that's just great. His finger looking good. I love it. But um, I've been loving these, man. To all you Norm McDonald fans, I really appreciate y'all letting me like helping me go down this rabbit hole because I'm having the best time. So let's, without further ado, let's let's check out the next one. I'm supposed to be streaming right now, but I don't care. I want to watch another one. Um. As a reminder, before we, we before we watch this, uh, like, subscribe, it means a lot, just to help support, it really, again, just means a lot, it's so much fun, but it's been so much fun connecting with y'all, y'all are some amazing, there's some amazing people out there, man, gosh, uh, that's been amazing, and then second, uh, I, I have seen just a couple of comments, people ask me to jump off the treadmill, sorry, this is what I, this is what I do, I try, I try to get 15, 20,000 steps in a day, so, we're going to keep reacting to these while I'm on here, but it is kind of fun when Norm has made me laugh so hard that I had to get off, the, jump off the treadmill just because, like, I knew I was going to fall. It's, it's great stuff. So, without further ado, let's check out what our homeboy, Norm, has got for us for this one. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic. What a fantastic yeah. intro. Yeah. It's fun doing jokes. Yeah. By the way, who? what is that guy's name? I know I could look this up for myself, but the only time I really research or do this stuff is honestly through the YouTube comments. So, yeah, who is that guy? I just feel like him because every time when No More Donald, for example, was laughing about the whole 9-11 thing, which for some reason was, I don't understand why it was funny, but it was. I feel like that guy. I feel him. Anyway. Uh why do dogs always race to the door when you uh, when the doorbell rings? It's almost never for them. <laughs> you know the funniest part of doing an office conga line? <laughs> when you look back and realize you're doing it alone and you're not in an office, you're in a psychiatric hospital. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been. <laughs> oh. Nice. On top of trends, I guess. You know, when everybody was burning CDs, I was still burning books. <laughs> Crowds in Brazil <laughs> greeted a, arriving Olympians with signs reading, Welcome to Hell. I had a wild night last night, boy. I was in a, an orgy. It was me, oh, my boy. iPad, my laptop, and TV while my phone watched. It's more of a comment, really. <laughs> I like that one. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, that was awesome. I'd like to take this moment to say I endorse podiums. That's a product I can stand behind. <laughs> what about this one? This is for That's you. That's good. Um, uh, yesterday I had a picture framed. Now it's doing time upstate for armed robbery. <laughs> uh, well, listen, Catherine Zane Jones admitted she is bipolar half the time. She's deliriously happy, and the other time she has to suck an old man's cock. <laughs> oh my God. Dirty. Come on, man. A new study shows that most men can identify a gay man by his face alone. It's the face that's <laughs> buried in another man's asshole. <laughs> oh, gee. Dude, does um, do y'all know? Does he write these? Oh man, I'm gonna love this video. I think puns and awkward jokes because they're just so crazy. Oh, dude, I'm all about that crap. <laughs> hey, how about this? The Dalai Lama said that killing in the name of religion is unthinkable. Hey, thanks, Dalai Lama. I'm sure everybody will fucking listen to you. No one listens to the Dalai Lama. No, no one. <laughs> I need to have glasses in order to. <laughs> see my family specifically two glasses of scotch <laughs> the al qaeda online magazine inspire has a recipe for a homemade bomb they also have a recipe for a pretty darn good peach cobbler <laughs> <laughs> not all bad you know? 
<laughs> a new study found that men with beards are more attractive than men without beards. Heck yeah. More great work from the University of Bob Seger. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's nothing cooler than being a lone wolf except at wolf picnics when you don't have a partner for the wolf wheelbarrow races. <laughs> <laughs> now listen, my girlfriend's mad at me right now. Last night when we were having sex, I yelled the name of her ex-boyfriend. Nice fella. <laughs> Surname you don't hear much anymore, Flintstone. <laughs> this one's more like a like factoid. That. Danny DeVito looks like one of those guys with a short but thick penis. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, dude, this is so great. <laughs> okay, here, what about this joke? Call me an old softy. But I'd prefer if you called me a distinguished gentleman with a flagging erection. <laughs> <laughs> John Wayne Gacy, man. Dude, um, guys, I'm really sorry how much I'm going to have to pause with these, but I just don't want to miss the next joke, so I got to... Sorry in advance. Not my idea of a clown. Not funny at all. No. <laughs> <laughs> that guy funny. I love Roseanne. Barbara Walters announced that she's retiring from The View. Well, actually, she announced it five years ago, but no one could hear her over those yammering bitches. <laughs> hey, how about this one? They say pimping ain't easy, Andy. <laughs> Yo, I went over. That was good. That was awesome. Because we all. I'm not going to say anything mean. Oh man, that was fantastic. <laughs> hey, how about this one? They say pimping ain't easy, Andy. <laughs> but what they won't tell you is it's much, much more difficult being a prostitute. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, this is freaking brilliant, man. <laughs> pimping is pretty yeah. easy. Barbara Walters is Pimpin's planning to announce her retirement. What's next for Babs? Death. <laughs> 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 well, in this while, when I was told I was going to perform for a bunch of drones, I thought I was being booked on The View. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. You ever read a book? Oh, you read that communist thing. Yeah, I read the Marxist manifesto. Who was the better man? It's a communist manifesto. Okay. Dr. Martin Luther King? Mm -hmm. Stalin. <laughs> hey, I, by the way, I've noticed the term adult toy always refers to something you can uh, shove up your asshole and never like a big race car, like for a grown up. That's another good observation. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're observation. Growing up, I never would have believed that one day I'd need a computer just to masturbate. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> It is strange when you think point. about it. In my opinion, <laughs> if you're going to fight the war on terror, a good place to start would be this nation's haunted houses. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I may have told you this, oh, but so dumb. my doctor's getting very rude. The last time I went to him, he said, open your mouth and say oink. <laughs> I remember, uh, the, you know, sometimes they get so PC about these things. That movie, The Last of the Mohicans, uh -huh. and they had a big protest. Apparently, they weren't using any actual Mohicans. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, white girls who wear big hoop earrings may be guilty of, quote, cultural appropriation, and they risk getting a curse put on them by peeved gypsy fortune tellers. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's Sarah Silverman. Uh... Do they have a history? The only reason I ask is like on my YouTube feed, some stuff has popped up from Sarah Silverman. Yo, his, uh, here, here's, okay, so I knew he had a show. I don't know, I don't know how long of a show, like how long it was written. Cause like, dude, he's got tons of people on there. It seems like he was like the last defense with, with comedy almost, man. Cause like. He's just letting it rip with these com with these comics, and they are finding this crap funny. Man, yeah, he was like the last offense against PC, huh? At least it's just feeling like it. I'm surprised to see these people interacting with him, like I really am. So, man, those are the good times. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. These are great <laughs> jokes, by the way, Steve. Congrats. Oh, good. As always. 
Here's one for you. Here. Artifacts from Auschwitz are set to go on tour wow. for the first time. You guys won't stop. Experts believe that this will be Miley Cyrus's darkest opening act yet. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Wow. I know the Bible says not to covet thy neighbor's wife. Right. But it doesn't say a damn thing about coveting thy neighbor's husband, especially a sweet, hot fucking asshole. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> What did I... <laughs> this is sweet hot. Is that in there? <laughs> hey, you're not going to believe this, but Bill Maher is giving away the solution to all our problems for free. <laughs> wow. Las Vegas is now home to a 550 foot tall Ferris wheel. Also drawing thousands to Las Vegas. Whores. <laughs> <laughs> My father was recently diagnosed with shingles, which is a terrible sickness that usually only affects roofs. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think the reason I most look forward to China ruling the earth is that all of their last names sound like slang for cock. <laughs> I'll tell you a joke. Like Wang. Wang's the best one. You know Wang? Wang means king. Yeah, it means king. Oh, man. You know they had a big black mass uh, devil worship this week, apparently? <laughs> but I skipped it because I believe you can be just as close to Satan on a golf course as in some stuffy old <laughs> satanic church. <laughs> Deep throat porn legend Harry Reyes. Yeah, he died, but how you are they going to close that, that casket? I mean, <laughs> no, no Swiss think I hate it. It's great. Thanks. This one says, remember the old days when tweeting meant stabbing a hooker? <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> well, this Lindsay Lohan can't swim. Do they do like a don't laugh challenge with him? I remember the, there was a video we saw with him reacting to the <clears throat> gold chain joke. You know what I'm talking about. Oh, gosh. Dude, time goes by so fast watching these. My goodness. Swim a stroke, but she sure knows every dive in town. That one I like. <laughs> I didn't get that one. Oh, I, didn't get I don't it. know much about G Guys, I'm rewinding it because I didn't get Geo it. That one I like. <laughs> Lohan can't. Okay, here we go. Bob well, Bob. this Lindsay Lohan can't swim a stroke, but she sure knows every dive in town. That one I like. <laughs> 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 I'm, I don't know much about geopolitics, but uh, that is one cool name for a country, Chad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, how about this one? Yeah, okay. A 28-year-old med student is auctioning off his virginity online. For three hundred thousand dollars, you can have the worst sex of your life. <laughs> <laughs> that's, good. that's brilliant, dude. Oh, dude, that's so funny. That ain't that's bad. Good. That's that ain't good. bad. Well, that's so funny. Sorry. It's Steve's. Oh, wow. Well. This is what you never hear. Uh, he made love to me in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> so a woman from Denmark I met at a party was telling me how awful she thinks Trump is. So I shot back, yeah, well, you guys have that asshole Hans Christian Anderson. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. It's just my uh, patriotism. <laughs> when I was a child, my parents told me my uncle was sleeping with the fishes, which at the time I assumed many bought a waterbed. <clears throat> then I found out he had been killed and his body buried at sea. Oh, <laughs> Dave, say what you will about Elon Musk, mm -hmm. but with his new plan to bring people to Mars, nobody is a more creative serial killer. <laughs> <laughs> a new report from the CDC states that only one third of Americans use condoms, while two thirds of Americans are still pretty cool. Get out! <laughs> <laughs> Why do you get a good one? <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was good. My dad would hit me with the belt sometimes. Yeah, you would have to but go get it. was get the worst one. when he was the reigning WWE. Uh, <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> You know, I was raised Catholic, and when people find out, they always assume there was some creepy priest involved, you know. But they never gotcha. suspect the deacon. <laughs> oh, oh, 
Okay. Adam Egan with a joke. Oh man. Whew. <clears throat> Phenomenal. Part two coming soon. Uh, tomorrow I'm gonna probably try to watch the twelve minute joke. So uh, watch for that one. Man, y'all, this is this is great. This is great. Talk about an easy way to burn calories. Just walk and watch Joe McDonald. <sighs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Guys, thanks for the recommendations. This has been a blast. Keep it real. Much love. Uh, move a little bit more. Walk a little bit more. And if you liked and, sub and subscribed, hey, give me ideas of what you want to see. Just because, hey, this is for you, man. Much, much love.